Over the past few days here, we have been discussing the fact that the SEC could very well potentially approve the spot Bitcoin ETF, which would then make this one of the most important weeks in Bitcoin history. While the SEC has also been going out of the way to make sure that they try to protect retail investors, well, ladies and gentlemen, they have just fumbled the bag in a way that I didn't see possible. They have come out and said that the SEC has approved the spot Bitcoin ETFs and said, here are the ETFs that have been approved. Following that, by just a few minutes, Bitcoin, just a few seconds, actually, Bitcoin decided to rip up from where it was trading roughly around 46,700 all the way up towards 47,800 almost 48,000 first time we've seen that level since what who knows 2021 before ultimately coming right back down to see roughly 44,800 some very wild volatility now just a few minutes after the sec who they would self-describe themselves as a very reliable source a valid source of information where people can trust then came out and said that their account had been hacked and that they did not approve the spot bitcoin etfs now here's gary gensler's tweet Okay, well, here's a screenshot of Gary Gensler's, Gary Gensler's tweet. The SEC Gov Twitter account was compromised and an unauthorized tweet was posted. The SEC has not approved the listing and trading of spot Bitcoin exchange traded products. This came out very soon after. They already came out and said that it, you know what? And I'm just gonna put this out there. I have no valid proof whatsoever, but I am gonna wait for Elon Musk to come out and say, hey, look, this account wasn't hacked. They just pressed the wrong button. I just, I think, I, I, I would imagine that they probably had a scheduled tweet for tomorrow after the market closes and they accidentally scheduled it for the wrong day. I have a theory. Something tells me that if there is some sort of investigation done in regards to this being posted from the S, and I don't even know who's going to investigate the SEC. Who's, who's supposed to investigate the, the SEC? Like who would be the, who, who, who? Who holds the SEC accountable here? I, real question. I, I wouldn't even know. Anyways, somebody is going to get in trouble for posting that early. And I think it was probably a scheduled tweet for the after the market close on Wednesday, which is the deadline day. And they accidentally just pressed it a day early. Right? Anyways, guys, let's take a look at this clip here. Uh, if you guys haven't yet, of course, guys, smash the like button, engage the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Hit that little bell notification so you guys get notified when I post videos just like this. Listen to this, guys. There is somebody right now who is very, very, very bullish that this is going to be approved despite the fact that SEC just pulled the bag here. You get past today. The SEC tomorrow says, okay, you're all clear. You can start trading on Thursday. How soon before you turn around and try to make other spot products for different crypto assets? You know, I think we're going to see a lot of filings come out for uh, Ethereum. I even think we might see something for Ripple, given uh, the recent progress. Uh, you notice that Grayscale just added Ripple to one of their trusts. It's publicly traded. So it wouldn't surprise me if we saw Ripple or Ethereum spot ETFs out there. I really don't know if we're going to do that or not. I think those are more retail plays and people have other ways to access them. But uh, given, given that this, this market, anything could happen, anything could happen. And, and Steve, just to clarify, because Shanali alluded to this idea that perhaps trading could begin as early as Thursday, have you received any indication from the SEC that you won't be granted approval tomorrow and that you couldn't start training, trading as early as then? Yeah, we haven't received any such indication. And by the way, nobody's really received indication that that absolutely is what is going to happen. Uh, the way that the SEC works is they don't say, hey, yeah, we're going to let you uh, go uh, Wednesday at four o'clock, um, you know, or, or th that is crazy because that is exactly when I would suggest the SEC is probably going to release the information just simply based off of when they released the information today. That, that This was shot hours ago. So the fact that that even came out way before this fumbling of the bag is crazy. Thursday, a week ago, uh, they, they, they will always constantly hedge themselves. We're prepared for a effective date on Wednesday and trading on Thursday. Uh, but we know that anything can happen. So I'm about 95% sure that uh, we will be trading on Thursday. All right, guys. So there you guys go. It's about 95% sure that they will be trading as early as Thursday. Absolutely crazy. Anyways, guys, that's all the information I got for you guys right now. If you guys haven't yet, of course, smash the like button, engage the video. I will be back with another video later on tonight to give you guys a good market overall coverage. Several of the different plays we did take today in the trading community. Again, guys, if you guys want, want more information on trading, uh, call outs, watch lists, educational videos, a wonderful community, guys. Link in the description below to jump in there for a trial. It is 50 cents a day for this trial right now until prices do change, all right? Much love, guys. See you guys on the flip side. Deuces.